So the purpose of this facility is to take the used water from the city of Boise, so everything you flush down the toilet, everything you put down your sink, your shower drain, it comes into this facility as influent, and then it leaves this facility as effluent, so as reclaimed water. The first thing that happens to this water is to take out all of the trash. People flush a lot of things they're not supposed to flush. It's about 8,000 pounds of trash taken out of our used water every single week. Oh yeah, there's a little bit. Sand and gravel, you know, just the small particles, coffee grounds are a good example. Corn, corn is something that people don't digest. There's about 5,000 pounds a week taken out of that grit to add on to the 8,000 pounds of trash. After the water has gone through the Headworks building, and it comes up to the center of this clarifier where it's allowed to settle. I like to think of it as a cup of hot chocolate. If you let that cup of hot chocolate sit for a long time, all of those heavy particles, all that chocolate is gonna sink to the bottom. Instead of being chocolate, it's obviously poop, your food scraps, all of those things that have kind of broken down. The operators and engineers utilize here are different types of microorganisms to get as many of those pollutants out of this water as they can. So this is the secondary clarifier. It looks a lot like the primary clarifier. The difference is that the heavy stuff in this clarifier are actually microorganisms from the aeration basin. This water is super high in nutrients, and so algae blooms happen really quickly. And so these ducks are just at an all-you-can-eat buffet of algae right now. Really similar to the aeration basin, they're just pumping oxygen in this water, ready to be healthy for aquatic organisms that live in the river. For a long time, they were using chlorine to disinfect water, denaturing those microorganisms. So UV light is a lot better for those downstream organisms that rely on clean water. And when it leaves as effluent, it's safe to touch, safe to fish in, and safe to swim in.